small devices have been increasing their power exponentially, and there's no better evidence than the Lenovo Yoga Slim 7i Pro X, which packs an H-Series Alder Lake CPU and the RTX 3050, in a very portable 14-inch chassis. It's made entirely of aluminum and uses rounded corners and edges, which is similar to what Apple has done with their recent MacBook redesign. All in all, the laptop looks great, especially the dark teal finish. For a smaller laptop, durability is exceptional, with almost no flex from both the lid and base, despite it weighing only 1.45 kilograms and having a profile of 15.9 millimeters. The lid also opens with one hand, revealing the keyboard and touchpad. However, the base also has two speaker grills, which will gladly take, as they both fill the space and serve a purpose. The keyboard has well-sized keys, with long key travel and clicky feedback. They're also backlit, which is great for night owls. The touchpad has a more premium glass surface, making it very smooth. However, while the clicking mechanism is good, it does get harder to press the higher you click. On the sides, we see the I.O. Things are pretty simply laid out, with the left side getting an HDMI 2.0 port and two Thunderbolt 4 ports. On the opposite end, you can see the audio jack and one full-sized USB port. The power button is mounted on the side as well, along with the e-shutter switch. What you'll look at once you buy the Yoga Slim 7i Pro X is a 14-inch IPS screen with a 16-10 aspect ratio, which is ripe for productivity. It's got a 120Hz refresh rate, so the user experience will appear smoother. It gets quite bright, maxing out at 415 nits, while also covering 94% of the sRGB color gamut. Color accuracy is important as well, and the device brings decent colors out of the box. However, with our design and gaming profile, it gets even better, with a delta E value of just 0.8. We'll have links to all of our display profiles. Only 2 per 100 people watching this video are subscribers. If you decide to just start following us, we'll be able to reinvest more in our laboratory thus making even more helpful videos for you. Thank you, you're awesome. How Lenovo managed to fit a 70 watt hour battery inside is beyond us. The unit does well, lasting for 8 hours and 53 minutes of web browsing, or 6 hours and 58 minutes of video playback. These results are with a configuration featuring the Core i7-12700H and the RTX 3050, which is maxed out at 55 watts. The Core i7 isn't necessarily what we would have picked for this laptop, however, the CPU still scores nicely inside both Cinebench and Photoshop, albeit there is still a big difference between the same CPU inside the Yoga Slim 7i Pro X and a gaming laptop. As for the RTX 3050, it does well for a 55W GPU, outperforming the Asus VivoBook Pro 14X and scoring similarly to the MSI Prestige 15. Keeping the powerful Core i7 cool is a setup with two heat pipes, two fans, and several heat spreaders, which cover a large part of the motherboard. The Core i7 doesn't reach its full potential, as the 100W Type-C charger doesn't supply enough power to power the CPU and the RTX 3050 and have some slack just in case. As such, the CPU runs at low clock speeds, temperatures, and wattage. On the other hand, the RTX 3050 reaches 55 watts without a problem, maintaining a stable clock speed of above 1500 MHz. Last but not least, comfort could be better, but that's just how it goes with smaller fully aluminum laptops. The base's hotspot reaches 45 degrees Celsius, while the fans can definitely be heard, even without the extreme performance preset. The Yoga Slim 7i Pro X comes with soldered memory. However, you can get up to 32GB of LPDDR5 RAM, which runs at 6GHz. For storage, you only have a single M.2 slot for Gen 4 SSDs, so whenever you're upgrading, you'll have a spare M.2 drive lying around. As always, we'll have our disassembly video in the description, so you know what to do when the time for upgrades or cleanup comes. While the CPU selection should definitely be revised, the Lenovo Yoga Slim 7i Pro X is a laptop without a lot of flaws, if any. Yes, it doesn't take full advantage of its processor, but the thing is still performing insanely well. If you need to know everything there is to know about the laptop, we have a more complex review on our website, 
which you can check out in the video description.